boy, we are in here. Random stream, no setup time, no nothing. What's going on, guys? In a second, I will be explaining why I call this the real talk stream. And I will be cooking up because, bruh, just a message for all the all these haters and shit that keep on talking shit to me, talking about I wasn't going to make it this far and all that. Bruh, dog, there's nothing going to stop me from this hard work ever. I'm just being real. And thanks for everybody tuning in and whatnot, man. I really do appreciate it. And the first thing I want to say before I even get into the real talk, yeah. Uh, Hopefully you don't have no kids watching because I am about to go 100% adult. 9 p.m. Put the kids to sleep because it's about to be real. Um, shout out to everybody that's in the chat. I, of course, I will have the chat up and I will be looking. You know, if you have questions or whatnot, I will be answering them momentarily. So, yeah, P.O.P. <laughs> so I'm going to check in with y'all right now. I'm about to say give a shout out to all the, all the people that chose to tune in. And I really do appreciate it. And you know how I do with the echo. So, Attila the cunt. I needed that. I needed that laugh. What's good? Three cool gang gang. What is good? DJ Young Al, what is going on? Louis, what's good? Mellow Beats, what's good? Original, what's good? Yo. Yo, yo, yo. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm on a four I'm on a four K TV day. Well boy. Man, I don't know what to say. <laughs> but yeah. Straight up, I just wanna say first off, I really do appreciate everybody that's tuned in and I thank you so much. I appreciate everybody that watches my videos and supports my channel 100%. I thank you. I thank you because you could choose anybody else. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sound like I've lost it to Craig Kenya. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, I really do appreciate y'all, man. You know, I worked really hard for this channel. And I know the channel has been struggling with content because, man, when I first got into it, bruh, I uh, just like I was telling my dog Ocean View. Shout out, shout out to real homies, man. Shout out to Ocean View, my dog. Shout out to S. Uh, damn, I can't even say his name. Zay Scott, my bad, man. Shout out to Lex Luger. Shout out to man. I can't the dang. I keep on forgetting people's names and stuff, man. I'm just stuttering. Don't worry about it. I, I stutter all the time. I just cut it out of my videos and stuff, so it seemed clean as hell. But no, DJ Plug, man. Shout out to you, dog. Shout out to DJ Spins. What's going on, J Rock 2K Beats? J Rock in the building with Joey. Yo, uh, do I master in Ableton? Absolutely, positively, some bit. Nah, I actually master in Ozone 8. That's what I rock with. Yo. What's that say? Uh, fine. I'm trying to say it. Finito, finito, so say, yo, what's good? So, man, like appreciate everybody, man. But the grind in 2015 all the way up to 2018 has been extremely hard. It's been nothing but difficult. But I've loved every second of it because I don't want any of the success that that I get. And you as a person should want the hardest road possible to reaching your success. I think it is very easy to say, man, it's not an easy task to get 26 K subs on YouTube. I know I ain't got no 3 million, no 8 million or any of this crazy stuff. Pootie pie got freaking 54 million and more power to him because he put in a lot of work on YouTube has been on this platform probably the longest than most of the people that are on this platform now now bruh but i'm tired of people that like to shortchange the success that has been on this channel yes absolutely i guarantee you 
that uh, a lot of people would be very satisfied with just 26,000 subs. I am pleased, absolutely pleased, but I'm not satisfied and I will continue to give you content. Now, my focus on my content on this channel is not to be putting out shit videos. That is not how that's going to work, player. I don't do that. I'm tired of doing that, and it actually backfired in my face from me making two two videos a day. That's that's daily vlogging on on YouTube is usually what propels you because you are making content for people to watch on an average, even if it's not the same amount of people every day. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Jay Budge said, "What content? Yeah, I understand. It's been very very short content this year, <laughs> but at I think I made like maybe 27 videos this year so far, which is far beyond, beyond uh, less than what I've done in the past uh, two years. But there's a reason for that. I am focusing on the quality of this content. <laughs> ASMR video. Maybe I should do an AM ASMR beat making video. That would be some terrible waste of time shit posting shit. But I'm pretty sure it'll probably get a lot of views because, you know, what I've learned, <laughs> what I've learned from making videos on YouTube, man, is the self, you have to you have to have that self enjoyment about what you're doing, because if you're going to put out videos every freaking day, the quality is going to drop unless you are super duper person. All right, and you got any giveaways? My brother, my brother, my brother. Another thing, nobody in the millions of, on YouTube has give, given away as much stuff as I have. I've given away equipment, money, and most people don't give away shit. Now, that's not to say that, hey, man, uh, well, it, uh, fuck the community and, and not award you guys for your excellence because that's not what I'm about now however uh, and then somebody has asked me what are your goals Av my goal is to continue to give good content and I'm in the the way people uh, what people don't understand is it is mad stressful to make YouTube videos on a daily basis bruh on a daily basis imagine that like what if I was to ask another content creator that has more that that's a, a realistic person, like somebody like Mr. Different, like Mr. Different, I can expect the real to come from him. None of that fucking Crayola childish bullshit like some other motherfuckers. And I don't care if somebody comes on fucking Twitter and fucking bashes me because I, I threw a subliminal. You know what? You know what? Deal with it, dude, because obviously you are a fraudulent person. And now I say when somebody is a fraudulent fucking person, I am saying that they are fraudulent because that they are sitting up there copying other people's shit, other people's damn content, and then not giving them credit. Dog, that is like 100% how we survive on these fucking YouTube streets, bruh. You have to credit somebody, man. You know what I'm saying? You have to give somebody credit. How in the fuck are you, you know, I understand people want personal glory of, of telling their audience and whatnot, and perhaps you don't want to help somebody out uh, that's doing something, but obviously, if somebody has motivated you to make a freaking video on YouTube that you freaking please give the credit to the person that has less fucking subscribers than you. I know I went from freaking to fucking boy. That's, that's, that's life. But you know, you have all these fucking like, dog, I give shout outs to people that have way less subscribers than me. The, and, and somebody talk about like the beat reviews, dog. I'm going to do a beat review this month. And I got my hand waving and shit, but I'm going to do beat reviews. That that is one thing that you can count on for me. That, that 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 is something somebody asked me a while ago, and all that. I had the most popular video get stolen three times on my channel. I believe you, my dogs. Um, all right. So Skill F asked me a question real quick, and he says, "Installing Windows on MacBook, good idea." 
I personally think that's not a good idea. If you're going to use a Windows OS, use it on a Windows PC. There's no advantages of having a MacBook over a Windows PC. As a matter of fact, Mac has been playing catch up to Windows PCs and laptops for the last couple of years. Matter of fact, Apple in general is, doesn't give a flippity flop about that part of their market anymore because they are focusing on making the iPhone so much better than everything in your house and make you use that only. So their main focus is not even on their, com uh, not that part of the computing at all. It's just that phone and the damn iPad. But yeah, what is going on, Young Benji Beats? Young Benji Beats, what is good? Paul Allen, what is good? Yeah. So... Paul Allen's giving a shout out so he wants the people to come to his channel. I'm all for what he's doing right now as long as it's in this pro proper perspective. Tonight, man, I just want p want to clear the air, dog. But also, man, I'm not... And, and there's this thing about somebody saying I'm a salty producer and all this shit, man. L listen, listen. Dog, this music industry I've been a part of, dog, it's not it's, it's not sweet for anybody. Obviously, this year there was a there was multiple producers talking about they haven't got paid for records that have been four to five fucking times platinum. The, so why in the world would I sit there and try to contribute to a music game that continuously fucks over music producers? Why? Why should I? So. I don't care what's what what this motherfucker is saying over here on the side here, dog, because obviously this person is generally a shit human being, dog. One, I'm going to tell you on keeping it one freaking thousand, dog. I just on Twitter just said to TM, much respect to you and yours. Last year, people were saying that I was a fucking bastard because I pointed him out for what he did. Now, I'm not trying to reflect on that moment because I am sick and tired of people saying that I'm doing this for clout because I don't give a fuck about that. And that goes into my point of what people keep on saying about my freaking channel, talking about people act like all of a sudden, like I, I just got 26,000 fucking subs because I, I, re I view, reviewed a story was first to break a fucking story on something that about somebody that is massively irrelevant even if he's supposed to be relevant in the music industry right now nobody gives a shit about you nobody cared as much as i did that's 100 because i am a good person i'm been pushed to the edge and people keep on thinking because i am very nice with my words which i'm not i'm a goofy stuttering person and i also get angry too and I blame that mostly on myself for not sharing and not airing out when somebody sits there and calls me something. I usually delete the comment. Sometimes I ignore it and be nice. And sometimes I do clap back. But you know what? If you are that type of person that's going to uh, come into my comment section and talk shit to me, bruh, I ain't like these other fucking YouTubers. Let's get this fucking straight. No, I do not want to sit here and be on this damn platform. Oh, uh, that's it's okay. It got caught. I thought the camera was about to fall over. No, I don't want to be on this platform, uh, pu pushing on bad vibes, showing people the worst part of life, talking about you know I'm the realest, this realest, that dog. I'm trying to build communities, dog. I have a responsibility, a responsibility as an adult, as a man, as a father, to be a leader and not do the what they expect people to do that are in a desperate situation dog and that's all i'm about is trying to persevere so if you want to clown me because i'm not sitting up here taking uh taking some weak ass fucking deal because there's big ass money dangling around me then go ahead clown me clown me clown every last producer that has the same ideas and understands at my age or even younger because i sit here and talk to a lot of young producers i do a lot for music producers in general when it comes to my videos are they always watchable hell to the gnaw not all the time are they watchable bruh but at the same time, man, I want people to take away something from it. I have to learn to be freaking crafty and, and make people laugh and shit like that. I'm not a naturally f funny person, bro. It is what it is. But exactly, dog. I'm not. It's, it's not about the money 100 percent of the time, dog. I'm, duh. First of all, I'm here for this. If I think about making money on YouTube, 
Now, I still be a broke ass nigga. Like, I'm broke as fuck right now. I still be broke. I'm not out here fronting, flexing. I'm not out here stabbing people in the back to fucking make a quarter mil, a million, and none of that shit, bro. But I guarantee you, dog, the way I work and the way I have good ethics, dog, I will never freaking lose, bro. I will never fucking lose. And so if you want to clown me on certain things, man, fine. I understand it when I understand when the video is not good. Okay. Um, sometimes I put in the work, think it's really good. Put it out. Of course, somebody's going to have a negative, a negative inconstant. I understand that uh, people are going to be objective to what information I deliver because it may not be, I might not be the, the chosen one that they want to believe when it comes down to the information. If I don't have the results that will meet up to their standards, but that's pretty much even producers that are multiple and are multi-platinum dog in a video that I did about music theory, uh, about the scalar VST by plugin boutique dog. I, I have, I had one of the most influential, most talented people in the world in that video, dog. And people are still objective to the how it was delivered. Bruh, he is Detroit Knicks. My dog is 100% legit, bruh. All the way. All the way. And there ain't nobody that can knock what he does in the studio, fam. Straight up, you want to you want to name any producer, bro? I put that dude on against anybody, and I'm putting my money on him. Period. There's a lot of talented people out here, guy. You got to you got to want this shit. I appreciate you, uh, young Benji. Appreciate you. Now, and I don't and I don't necessarily focus on the negative shit, bro. But that's what fucking YouTube, that's what's popular on YouTube, dog. Like, I could easily sit there and, and make sh it shit videos and shit on people, dog. And it will get more views. And as long as I keep it about music, what? who cares, right? All right, so uh, Clark, uh, Clark Ball says truth. Uh, we do it for the love. And, bruh, watch all the time shit uh, keep up. Uh, with it now, I think that's what he said. I'm I'm a little bent in the head right now, but between between you and Ocean, I find out more from y'all than any other website. I really do appreciate that. That's all I really appreciate, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm not sitting up here and don't get me twisted, man. I I got much love and respect for every last one of you guys. You know what I'm saying? Whatever is useful, dog. I, I like to get. I like to give people their props. I've done it so many times. I just gave Mister Different props. That is my dog for real. Like I can call Mister Different on the phone and chop it up with him, man. And there's plenty. And it goes from the, from there uh, and many more people. I, I don't know what's up with me and my talking, but that's how I am, Picasso. Maybe you should give credit for using samples, though. Uh. Or using samples hmm I don't know uh, as far as samples yeah I, I, uh, there's no way you can sample anything and then not somebody say it's theirs or something like that uh, sampling boy you'd be surprised I uh, appreciate that TJ beats yeah you know, you know and I, 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 I and, and, yeah and, and shout out shout out to trap monsters too man there's a lot of people that, uh, that I talk to, man, and, you know, I really just want to work with them or just have a conversation to sit down. I've been invited to many of them, bro, from different scales, man. One, one of the things that really shocked me last year was that Honorable C-Note gave me a chance to even talk to him. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people, you know, when, when you expect, it's always the people that you don't expect to be cool, to be really cool. And I'm not not to say that Honorable C note. I thought Honorable C note wasn't cool. I mean, when he did the conference and whatnot at at A three C this uh, last year, he was a really cool dude. Same thing with Brian Michael Cox, and and those dudes had people in the crowd that was just disrespecting them in their face, and nobody's at that. 
you know, uh, like me personally, I don't I don't want to shit on nobody. I don't care if you don't have a hit or not. The one of the the main sayings that I really like that somebody said is I treat the CEO with the same respect I treat the janitor or it might be I treat the janitor with the same respect as the CEO. That's one of my favorite quotes. And it came from one of my friends that that's been that 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 knows. He he knows. He's, you know, and I understand, man. My name is Trap Tendo, and people are already gonna think like, man, that's some goo. Either they thinking it's a goofy shit, or or people think that, yo, like he's on some other shit, like for real, like either on some other shit, like oh, his music is on some other shit, or he's on some other shit for real. Duh, man, this Trap Tendo shit is is real, bro. It is real, bro. Like, and I don't say it's real. Like, we bang out here banging Trap Tendo, and we got fucking red do rags, a uh, red red do rags, red uh <laughs> headbands on. What what red bandanas? Here we go, and, and we out here like that, man. You know what I'm saying, bro? It's just this movement is far more important than sitting up here trying to prove shit to a lot of cats, man. You know what I'm saying, like for real. Hell yeah, he need, and, and I really appreciate people like Honorable Cino, and he's funny too. Word, appreciate that Willie Wester. Oh, we 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 still cooking in, we still cooking up these uh, preset banks, man. I just wanna, I wanna express it. I wanna use my platform to speak my mind on something that really has been bothering me, you know. And I'm 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 gonna cook up too, man. You know, I just been messing with some music, and whatnot. Uh, shit, like. Like this whole like man, I, I owe it all to you guys for for what y'all have done for me for real. Y'all could have choose anybody, but you choose to watch me, and that to me is the most important thing, bro. For real, <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck? Anywho, that's this window when this window shit is wilding right now. Yo, know, I'm not worried about this, this petty shit. It's just got to stop, bro. <clears throat> like, if if you if if I know there's people that don't fuck with me, I know there is. There's people that just just automatically just don't like me. They probably might not like uh, the way I tell you what where I demonstrate shit. Most people, I don't even talk to them to, or uh, or randomly disrespectful unless we're talking shit about video games, bro. Like I play Dragon Ball Fighters, I love it. That's my game. It's my shit. So I play it. You know what I mean? But yeah, man. Like I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm over this, this bullshit that people just keep on uh, talking, man. <laughs> like I'm over it. Yeah, I'm gonna pull up the chat while this shit load up. You know, Ableton got to load the project and whatnot. Yeah. And the thing is, I do free down. And the reason why I do free download Friday is not the, 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 the have just throw, throw some out there. I, I, there's free quality content made by some massively popular, um, massively, well, not even popular, some, some companies that don't get the representation of something like that. Oh, well, what up, Paul Allen? Yeah, 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 man. I made the switch from Ableton uh, to Ableton from Fruit Loops last year. Oh, man, I said Fruit Loops. I apologize. I know how you guys are about that. Um, A lot of people avoid Ableton for some reason. Because Ableton, I don't know, a, well, from the FL Studio heads that, that k continuously talk shit in the FL Studio versus Ableton Live video, it's because the way it looks and the piano roll. Uh, the way it looks is not sexy at all, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> you know, it is what it is. I'm going to play this joint real quick, though. I'm, I'm still working on this. Um, but, yeah, I've been linking up with uh, some people from Chicago, man. Shout out to Chicago Rob. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, the, my, the gang in them, Chicago, is so I, I keep on forgetting how many people I, I know from the shot, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, I'm... <sighs> That the, it goes back to Trap Tendo, man. It is. I'm not doing no dirt now, you know. And, and 
the hell even talking about it from talking about the past. But damn, dog, a lot a lot of dudes under, don't understand, man. The, the, when they talk about this gang shit, yo, what what really fucked me up really with this gang shit on some real shit was seeing a friend of mine die when he was in seventh grade. He was murdered, bro. Burying your best friend, dog. There's there's all kinds of situations that can come from shit like that. Somebody you talk and hang with, and in most cases, man, I've always been doing music even before I played basketball. Yo, and seeing that was seeing that to this very day is a fucking wicked, uh, wicked shit, yo. Burying your friend at twelve, your best friend. Real talk. Nigga, that's sad, bro. And and he was dope at rapping. I always wanted to make beats. I'm still shit. But yeah, man. I don't know. That's just brought... I'm depressed as fuck. But, dog, I just want to keep it wanted. Just don't understand. don't understand. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Mama still tripping while I'm in the kitchen, just sitting and working my plan. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Maybe she'll get it when I hit it big in a minute and send her some bands. Uh, I am the new generation. They say that I'm lost and that I never make it according to my education. But they got it wrong because I stay on my hustle and there ain't no need for debate. I came up from nothing. I shouldn't be playing this, man, because we still working on this record, man. But what, whatever, man. Homie is tight. The moves that I'm making, the truth, they can't fake it. They usually take it and run. But there ain't no room for mistake. And this boy is amazing. And he's going places so young. I am the truth. I am the son that my mother raised. I am the youth. I am but one of the ones who have made it through all of the craziness. I am the proof. All of my good looks and all of my talent and all of my swagger, I get it from you. Mama, I do not think I could be great as I am or somehow if it wasn't for you. You are my first love and you are the reason. Appreciate that, young bitchy. What I do. I know sometimes I may act like a fool, but whatever I'm doing, I do it for you. Parents just don't understand. Parents just don't understand. Mama's still tripping while I'm in the kitchen, just sitting and working my plan. Parents just don't understand. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Maybe she'll get it when I hit it big in a minute and send her some bands. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Parents just don't understand. Don't understand. Mama's still tripping while I'm in the kitchen, just sitting and working my plan. Parents just don't understand. Damn. Shit, bro. Man, for real, man. Y'all, I'm, man. Throw a one in the chat, man. If you, a, if you a part of the struggle, man. If you know how hard it is out here, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, how hard this music shit is for real, man. Throw a one up, man. If you struggle, man. For, for real, throw it up in the chat. Word, naughty. Word. What? Word, word, word. <laughs> Busy threw up another one. Word up, man. <laughs> Yo, word. I see y'all. Jones. Sondaz. What is it? What is it? Sondaz. Sondaz, man. I, 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 don't, I hate messing up y'all names. I am Chops. What? That better not be the same motherfucking chaps from uh, <laughs> Rock Battle. <laughs> if it is, man, what up, my dog? And if it's not, man, what up still, man? It's all good. Uh, nah, I haven't, upda I haven't updated to Ableton 11. I mean, Ableton 10. Whoa, how how do I say 11, yo? But I, I'm about to. I just been, I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. I'm, I'm I I asked the dude. It, it kind of they kind of triggered me when they didn't uh, allow me to uh, test out the beta. I was like, whoa, like for real? I don't matter like that. <laughs> All right, <laughs> whatever, man. I guess I'm irrelevant. But yo, know, I now don't think that was really the fact. It, it was, he, the people at Ableton they said that there was a lot of beta testers that they had and whatnot, and you know. It is what it is. It was a, it was a whole bunch of shit, but it was like, damn, dog. Whatever. 
yo. But that's good though, cause I, I don't want y'all to be thinking I'm fanboying that that this this DAW dog. I really truly like working over this over FL, cause the fact I can finish a I could finish a whole entire song in this. Yo, FL twenty is on the way. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure I have it too. I have it first day, and I'll I'll see what's up. The last test it didn't do well. The last beta didn't test very well. What made you switch? Jones asked me what made me switch to uh, Ableton. It is purely the workflow. I mean, of course, you know, FL Studio Gang, you know, uh, they, you know, FL Gang was like, yo, Ableton looks ugly as fuck. And it does. This shit, this DAW looks like it doesn't look very cute. But I'm not using it because it's cute. I'm using it because of the workflow and how fast I can make beats in that bitch and, and how fun it is to use the push. You know, FL Studio doesn't have a MIDI controller that that works fully with the DAW. Ableton does. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of people use the piano roll, and that's the second best thing about FL Studio because obviously it has the best piano roll of them all. So you know, Ableton's piano roll isn't that good. Sorry, Ableton, y'all niggas need to re improve that shit. And I'm just keeping it in one thousand, but it's good enough. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lay that beat out, but that was that's from the last stream. I'm about to, uh, yo, I'm 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 going fully cook. Yo, when you depressed, man, you gotta make them beats, man, straight up. Yo, I see you, uh, Khalid the criminal. <laughs> I saw you, my dogs. I I didn't see the what what do you use for your sub monitor? I don't use a sub monitor at all. I I'm good with the Rocket Fives. The Rocket Fives, my room is really small, so I don't need no six, no eight, no rocket, whatever else. I just have these because they're very good at what they do, but I highly what is good? Zom City, what is good? Yo. Um, and I'm good with them because I mean I'm good with my headphones. Like I, my headphones matter to me the most because dog, I got neighbors. Like my upstairs neighbor is a fucking bitch, and I'm saying this like that because it the motherfucker earned it. They are a fucking bitch. I have many multiple neighbors that have never complained about my music being loud, and this asshole did it. And then they fucking blast their music. And you, you know you try to you, you know you try to be a cool ass dude and just not trip and not act like a fool, dog. I'm not trying to go back to motherfucking jail for assault, but bruh, people ask for this shit like they ask for it. So you know I'm gonna let the universe play, and that fucker will get what they was deserved one day. And I'm not wishing that on them, but it's true. Cook up with Big White Beat Kit. Um, I do have a kit from Big White Beats. Uh, I think that's his name, Big White Beast. It's always been a weird name that that person had, and the kit was fire. <laughs> yeah, dog, this is fucking bullshit, bro. My upstairs neighbors, be, uh, be uh, upstairs neighbors on some other shit. You know, I I, I personally don't want to be that person to just say, you know, just just disrespect somebody. Maybe that passive aggressiveness is what has earned me this anger tonight, bro. But, yo. Yeah. Busyworkbeast.com. Like he needs the promotion. <laughs> that dude that dude is shining. Man, no doubt about that. I as much as as much as he has triggered me and I realize that people that, that's the thing. Like I have to make sure that I'm not listening to the wrong people when it comes down to talking when somebody is did talking shit. Because again, Every person that I have, uh, I've been the vocal and the leader and the rumbler, dog. They straight up will, will, will always, always, dog. I, I, if you the, if you're the nigga that pops off my nigga for your friend, cause your friend won't fucking pop off first, yo, dog. Stop being that dude, one hundred. Because as soon as you pop off and you fight and shit, man, you're gonna find out who your real friends are right then and there. Because that motherfucker's gonna a run. He's either gonna throw hands with you, which that's what he should do. He should have uh, knocked that person out. Which I'm not a, uh, encouraging violence at all. I think you should walk away from a situation, regardless of how that might that shit might make you weak. Look weak, bro. You're not weak for being positive in a negative situation. 100% believe that. Because I'm telling you, once them folks put them cuffs on you, my dog, 
you're going to feel like shit because the next couple of, it could be the next couple of years or the rest of your motherfucking life, dog, you don't have what more that we still fight for on the outside. But dog, you're going to have to listen to a motherfucker tell you when to wake up. They, you're going to have to deal with a person that, digging in your shit because they, you think you might gonna shank somebody. You're going to die. You're on some, you're on the government's time. My dog, it needs to be less of us in prison period. I'm not just speaking to just the black people. I'm talking to all people for real. <clears throat> but yeah. <laughs> I got it. Yeah, I am. I'm just funny. Yeah. Yeah. Dog, I, you know, I, I know I'm a goofy looking motherfucker. I sound a fucking goofy way. But man, I'm telling you, dog, that this positive, this positive work, bro, is going to pay off. And I'm about to sample some shit. Damn. So that's what we doing right now. I got some weird ass records anyways. All right. Well, you can see this right here. Double face. <clears throat> I wonder what made me get this. This is a, this is an Italian record. A lot of really dope music from around the world comes to Italy first, yo. I bet uh, I bet the uh, <laughs> people gonna rip the hell out of this fucking video. I don't even give a fuck no more. Hiding behind avatars and talking shit. Yeah, do what it do. What? Mega DJ Center is closing their store down. Uh, they usually take weird days off, but I don't think they're closing their store down. I hope not. I love Mega DJ. Oh, shit. Hold up. Hold up, guys. Fuck it. I'm going to play this record backwards. Oops. Ooh, hold up, bro. Ooh. Yo, <laughs> uh, let's go. Let's go, Ableton gang. <laughs> FL gang, no doubt. Y'all, I'll still rock with you guys as well. Please believe it. I'm just waiting for FL. To, to do that one thing I need them to do. Well, not one, but a couple of things. And I'm just hoping the best, man. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mega DJ Center is live and in, in, in full effect. I hope they always will be in full effect. Back to work. I fu Yo, Willie, I appreciate you, my dog. Oh, let's get this shit. It's, yeah, it's still FL gang. No doubt. Nah, I can't, I can't, I'm not turning my back on FL gang, period. Like, never. Like, you know, it's like you turning your back on where you came from, you dig? All right, let me mute this mic. Oh, <laughs> 
Bruh, this sample though, holy shit. Oh boy. Have I ever tried Bitwig Studio? No, I haven't, but I'm pretty sure a lot of people say it's pretty good. But again, uh, my main reason why I fucks with Ableton is because the DAW and the hardware is dope. This hybrid MIDI controller. That part right there, though, that shit just, I don't know. And you already know, I'm about to throw the motherfucking hats in this bit. Yo. So, hi hats. Like the thing that made me stick with Ableton is the fact that I found a workflow that works for me and it's uh, double the time in than I would in like FL. And once I, f I discovered that, that was the end game. You know, all right. So Set this loop to oh nope. Set this to four. I gotta turn fixed link back on. I'm a little out of it right now because I'm like went went pure bitch mode on YouTube because bruh, I just had to let that shit out. Now, I'm gonna just be keep it 100 and just air. You know? Oh no 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 no. Play that shit back, boy. Yep. All right. And now I need some drums. Now this is this is where it all can fall apart. I don't know if, if I like to flex. Shoot. Let me load that to see if I I can fly with those. No. Oh, 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 let's 
go. Fuck. Yo, I gotta change something real quick though. Yo. Ah uh, no 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 no. Let's let's go. Up uh, oh. <laughs> Trap monsters, what's good? Word, word. I need to flip that sample some more though. <laughs> Do the voice thing. <laughs> Orange cucumber, what is good? that again uh damn that's how you know Boy, this is an Italian record, boy. What's happening? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's go. All right, let's go. Oh, hell no. Nah. What the hell? What's that? Oh. Oh, that's the... Yo... Ah, I keep on fucking up, bruh. This is, this is why. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. I gotta add them 808s. Fuck it. Bro, we just gonna ride this 808 shit to the ground, bruh. That's what it is. Fuck it. 21, 21. Hey. <laughs> they always I had bars, bruh. <laughs> uh, that might be a little too low. Um, I guess it would be a harmonic minor. Yep. Eh. Woo. Hundreds and fifties, big ass titties. Hey. Hundreds and fifties, big ass titties. Hey. 
Friday after next. Friday after next. Friday after next. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 20s and 50s, big ass bitties. I'm up in your city. Oh, let's get it. Yeah. Yeah. Doing everything slow today because my brain is on. A billion, trillion
changing the filter on the sample so I can get some of that that bass that was in that sample out. And then I'm gonna need to add. I'm gonna add a device. I'm gonna add a reverb. Dang. Well, damn. Pitch reverb would do this a little bit of justice. Hey, Woo. Picking out some drums, trying to see some stuff. There's a lot of stuff that I just haven't had the chance to use that that really can go with this. Um, let me check out Imagine real quick, see what that's good at. Hey, heading and heading and heading and heading. <laughs> I, uh, okay, tonight I'm I'm just playing some. I'm not there. I'm just. <laughs> it's really uncomfortable the way I'm sitting. I'm gonna show you. Like, bro, I be having the microphone like straight up, like right here in front of my shit, and I can't really get the the timing and stuff right.
All right, I'm gonna leave this right here. All right, I'm gonna check in with you guys. Yo, what's going on, DJ Georgie Porgy? DJ Georgie Porgy, what is good? It looks like Oskino BK. What's good, Steve's? What's happening? Hey. All right, I'm going to name that track. I'm going to work on it some more. Uh, <laughs> from my experiences with, with uh, sending tracks to people, you know, I, I like people to have their input as well, you know what I'm saying? So I just don't even try to go all the way out on a track. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But I'm not going to go all the way out on that. <laughs> that simple uh, line will do for right now. Uh, let's see. But I do, I'm going to get back to that record, though. And... But yeah, that's a French... Uh, damn, not French. Pardon me. That is an Italian record. And it's a symphony... Uh, it's hard to find good orchestra records. It really is. Like most of the stuff that people sample is always very, very, very popular. And like stuff like this, like it never be on YouTube because the the guys they they're probably just don't want their stuff to be online like that. So that's why they press up records because they make money selling albums, and they'll print up like a small number and continue to make music grind that way. It's small grind. Groove one. Let's see what else this joint got. Try not to show off my butt crack here, but whatever, man. I heard some pretty good stuff. Bruh, shit, this record is really hot. Yo, this bracket is really good. I can hear like stuff as I play it for. I'm reversing stuff on on vinyl and sampling it in reverse. This is not something I invented, of course. Obviously, there's been more many people to do it. The first person I knew that reversed uh, samples was Mr. DJ uh, at a uh, well, that Mr. DJ, which is a producer that produced a lot of Outkast shit. Like, uh, I, I want to say he produced. Yeah, he produced Elevators. A whole bunch of stuff, man. A lot of y'all may be too young to even remember that. We probably weren't even born because shit. <laughs> my my young my 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 young was wasn't even born when Outcast was really popping like that. Damn. No offense to the smart fans, but Jesus. So many idiots. <laughs> oh. Damn. So let me go ahead and create a new track, a uh, new uh, project. Yeah. Bro, I might sample this uh, regular. Woo! <laughs> Bruh, what are you talking about? Might do Trapping in Heaven Part 3. Uh, shout out to Emotional Tokyo. That, that's the dude that that had the, that has the dope-ass Trapping in Heaven series. He was the original person, as far as I know. Somebody will... You can always tell me if that's not true or not. <laughs> it, it ain't my business anyways. I'm not making the other people's stuff my business anymore. <laughs> Yo, 
Alright, so I'm going to sample that shit real quick. Let's go. Okay, I keep on uh, finding stuff on this record, and then I had to tap the tempo in. Because I wanted to be, you know, I'm using stabs, so I want everything to be perfect. And after, yeah, whatever, man. I have videos on that shit. Let's go. All right, I ain't know exactly what was going on in this record, but I'm, a, I'm just gonna re-needle it. Yeah, I got, I'm gonna re-needle this shit. All right, let's go. Vert, simpler. Yo, let's see. Oh shit, no wonder. That did not convert correctly. So where are we at? Ah, uh, fuck. <laughs> Boy, I was bugging. See, this is one thing I do like about Ableton. Boy, that undo button is real. Undo custom action. Ooh, undo mini controller action. Ooh, custom action. There we go. Go. Thank you. 
what's that count? Ooh. Ooh. What is that though? Okay. Yeah, seventy at seventy two. Okay. You damn right. We gonna do trap beats all fucking night. even listening to the uh, metronome right now. I'm brain as fuck. Damn, bruh. I'm really fucked right now on my brain. Dickens. Oh no. Oh, I know what happened. See, it doesn't warp it times two. <laughs> warp it times two and see what happens. Well, let's go. See, the thing is, it's not the way that the song plays that is so free flowing. It's no tempo to it. So, like, it is not going to be on beat. And I could make it that way, but it requires more work. I might just revisit that because I, I warped it times too. See, I, I think I see what you come, where you're coming from with that. I just warped the times too, and fucking with this. No, nothing's coming out with soul. See, it's soul. Yeah, that shit is... Yeah, this has a better chance of surviving, I guess. Uh, I 
think I can do that. Yeah, I mean, I can. Where's global? Yeah. Transpose it down a little bit. Now, I don't. I think that's too many stabs. the fuck bro Speed up the BPM, <laughs> bruh. Nah, I mean, I don't know, bruh. Like, <laughs> to me, it don't, it's not worth the struggle. <laughs> this is simple. Uh, see, I would dump that shit. Like, move on. Because to me, if you if you don't got a good sense of your groove, and you sitting there just trying to experiment and fuck with something that just doesn't speak to you immediately, is you always can go back to that shit. Let's see. Like, this shit is not really speaking to me. Yeah, see. Even the drums. <laughs> Look at that. See, it's so ass that the drums wouldn't even on point. Yeah. Let's see if that might be the case. fade out there <sighs> what the fuck <laughs> like the fuck is this about
<laughs> Bruh, nah. If I had drummed that bitch out, it's definitely not a, it's not a go, bro. This shit is whack. This is ass, bro. <laughs> even I, even I won't deny the fact that something sounds pretty bad. I love the drums, the drum choice, and all that. Well, I don't, I don't love the drum choice for this sample. Um, <laughs> I can't. I can't. This shit sound like, uh, it's not that bad, but I, I don't know. Bruh. Yo. Yo. Uh. The sample itself needs a little bit of stuff. Like a filter, because it doesn't have enough air in it. This beat is so bad. <laughs> oh, man, this beat is trash, bro. We did it, Internet. We did it. <laughs> okay. Uh, now that that is over with, y'all got y'all laughs in. Uh, it's nothing nothing about the... Well, this, this, yeah, the sample is fire, but everything else about the what I did was trash, bro. It's very trash. Um... And yes, that's another thing I like. When when you don't use the sample or whatever, the Ableton will delete it. It will it will ask you to delete the sample, so that way you don't have so many files on your computer, and then you run up and use up all your space or whatever. It's good at file management. That is why I rock with Ableton Live. It thinks for you, baby. It thinks for you. All right. Now that that tragic shit was is over. With, uh that was horrible yeah i have nobody to blame but myself on that one right so ow <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> you like the trumpets <laughs> i don't know I don't, uh, i'm not a trump man more props to any producer that can sample like brass stabs and stuff like that uh, man like you are the man you should sample cheech's chong <laughs>
If Cheech and Chong had a record, I probably would have it. I know that. Bruh. And that re and this record I have right here actually had some more good shit, but I I'm I want to float to something else. It's all about discovering the night, bruh. I think it's almost time for time for me to uh, rant for like a half an hour. Or it was like 12 minutes or so because I was mad as fuck. And Vereshwaka. I bet I bet the copyright strikes are so vicious. Well, it's not. Let me stop calling them copyright strikes. The the copyright claims like guys that you know the records and shit like that. You know, you know when you sample, you just don't get you. You're, you're not gonna get a lick of cash off of fucking YouTube, bro. Y'all don't understand, fam. There's something when people ask me about sampling tutorials and all that shit, I'll be like, bro. You know, this YouTube shit is my very like lifehood likelihood, and man, every time, I don't even like it when it's music that I am a part of, like. I want to eat off my motherfucking YouTube channel sometimes, bro. Yeah. This is very schwaka. Uh, schwa very schwaka. This this composer is actually he's also Italian. I read about him. Uh Enin I can't say his name right. I think it's Enin Morcone. Enin uh Morricone. That that, that doesn't sound right, Morricone. Enon Morricone and he's a he's Italian. I just sound like an ass. That's that vinyl called what's that vinyl called? I'm trying to fall asleep high to it tonight. <laughs> Uh, yes. Uh, I don't know if he was talking about double face or whatever. Good, uh, good luck finding double face on the air. Let, let's find, let's see if base internet actually has that. Let's go base internet. Uh, I guess I have to open up a new window or some shit. Whoa, what the fuck was that breaking? Uh oh. Oh. My privacy thing. Fuck. Shit. You buy cheap ass shit on the internet, man. Alright. Let's go. Alright, it's the YouTube live dashboard. So I need a YouTube anyway, so I'm gonna type in double face. <laughs> Let's see. Come on, bruh. Come on. And it's usually slow when I'm on, uh, when I'm streaming anyways. Yeah, let me see here. Uh, Double face. Let me see if you actually, if it don't pop up like that. I'm typing OST. <laughs> See, there's a face off soundtrack. Oops, what the fuck is going on, B? Oh. <laughs> Sound. Nah. You ain't gonna be vibing to this tonight, bro. See, man, when I, when I buy vinyl, when I buy when I buy vinyl. Uh, when is the n next beat review stream? I, I, it'll probably be Saturday. Well, and if if not, if it's earlier than Saturday, I will uh, I will let you know via the community tab. Or you'll basically when you're on YouTube, you know, you'll see like the when it's gonna start and whatnot. It, it'll be in the top of the of the whatever thing the story thingy i don't know bro i'm just not good with all these words <laughs> uh, yeah oh never mind i was about to read the same thing again 
Yeah, but yeah, nah, when I sample, I, I sample as most obscure as possible, get records from like shit that people won't really pick out, but might be classics. putting this shit on because uh, I, I gotta hear it. I have listened to this before. Yo, this be- this Ferris Walker right now. I heard something on there, but bruh, <laughs> I heard some shit on here. All right, no, that's gonna be stri- uh, copyright striked in. <laughs> Damn, well, co- copyright claimed or whatever, man. <laughs> Only one beat tonight, I, I I presume, and that was okay. That was wasn't the dopest. I don't know if I want to jazz here. I don't know if I want to even. I don't know. Shit, guys. Sorry to be abrupt, but fuck, I'm out to go. <laughs> I enjoyed your rant. <laughs> oh, there'll be plenty more. I'm not about to just sit there and just swallow up and and take shit to the chin, yo. That is not me no more, bro. I'm I'm tired of fucking uh playing playing games and being nice with these people with people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sit here and bottle up stuff no more, man. Like for real. Like people are gonna have to know, man. Straight up. But yeah, I think. I think. Uh, I gotta get ready to skedaddle. 
Now I gotta make some phone calls anyways, dog. Been mad busy this year. It's been it's been a really good year. I know I haven't been on YouTube a lot, and you know I'm gonna I'm gonna start just keeping it one thousand and wrapping it up with you guys a lot more than just not. You know what I mean? So. So yeah, these dudes is and what's up with people and sharing me shit. Um, yeah, man. But anyways, guys, man, I'm about to be out of here. Uh, I was so mad and I I wasted a lot of y'all time time with that ramp, but man. I just had to, you got to express yourself sometimes when, when people just frustrate you. So you just don't uh, end up doing anything physical because man, you, you don't know, like, you know, we all in, in an act of discipline with people that, that are, are of respect, you know, you don't have that, but if pers uh, a person disrespect you, dude, you don't got to take that shit, man. You ain't got to take somebody disrespecting you. I don't think anybody should just uh, stick around and just because of a situation is sweet and might it might be money involved and all that and it's a bad situation for you dog straight up like make those make those executive decisions before you become an exec to not fuck with somebody you know what i'm saying i and i know the language is isn't uh youtube friendly but fuck that you know is to i'm to a point to where i think people should should understand that i'm an adult I understand that there are kids that be on this channel. I do apologize, but man, the anger that I have for this person is ridiculous. Like, I'm tired of this dude writing me thinking that he could just talk shit to me and think, uh, and think I'm not going to say nothing. But anyways, guys, I appreciate all you guys. Just like I started, I'm going to end it. I appreciate y'all checking in, man. I know it was a lot more people earlier. I know that that shit beat really was depressing. And uh, yeah, guys, 1,000. Thank you so much. I really do appreciate that. Um, But yeah, guys, I really do appreciate y'all support and stuff. Uh, and we 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 gonna keep we gonna keep it moving, man. A lot of people, some people just don't deserve your attention, and they when they reach out for it, it is what it, uh, they they I don't know. People reach out for that bullshit. Anyways, guys, I'm out of here. I'm gonna step y'all up. We out later. Crab Tendo. <laughs>